Shalom and uh, welcome to Expert on the Spot. I'm Professor Sari from the Rakach Institute of uh, Physics in uh, Edmond J. Safra campus uh, in the Hebrew University. Um, I've done both my master and PhD here at the Hebrew University. Then I went to the California Institute of Technology for nine years. And three years ago, I came back here to the Hebrew University. I'm now also the chair of the board of the Bloomfield uh, Science Museum just across uh, the street here. Today, I'm going to tell you a little bit about my research. Um, as you uh, probably all know, we have a huge universe. The universe is composed of many, many galaxies. Each galaxy is composed of many, many stars. And some of these stars are actually solar systems. They have planets, smaller objects like the Earth, orbiting around those stars. And my research is trying to understand how these planets came to be, how frequent they are, and can we expect systems which are very similar to our own, so maybe we can expect uh, life on these other systems. The way I'm attacking these questions is in two main directions. One is uh, uh, understanding the properties of planets around other stars. In the past 10, 15 years, we have discovered more than 400 objects around other stars, and they have peculiar properties, like very eccentric orbits and very short period orbits. They are very, very close to their stars. And we're trying to understand how that came to be, how those systems evolved, and one, why are they different from our own solar system. The other direction, is uh, the investigation of regions in our own solar system <coughs> where lots of smaller objects exist. We believe these are regions in which uh, planets were beginning to form and didn't get to completion. Those two regions are the asteroid belts, a distance of a few times that of the Earth to the Sun, and the Kuiper belt where Pluto is, which is 40 times the distance of the Earth to the Sun. Uh, these regions contain rocks which are like these or like that, which are from kilometer across to hundreds of kilometer across, and they contain thousands of them. Some of them are colliding and breaking, and some of them are pristine, uh, giving us information about the very early uh, solar system. So uh, I hope this... Uh, uh, touched your curiosity a little bit and I uh, invite you to come and ask me questions and upload them to the site and I'll do my best to answer them in a week's time. Thank you very much.